Hey. So today I'm gonna show you guys how I make my eyebrows match my hair without any dyes. It's not healthy to put dye on your face, but if you do, more power to you. So first and foremost, I start off with my Kat Von D brow dip. It's called 24 Hour Super Brow. And trust me, it is it's super brow because it sticks. So it's a little effort to wash it off, but it's in the color Scarlet, which is red like the Scarlet letter. But because, brain part. Oh yeah, because my hair, my real hair, like my hair is not as red as this. I'm gonna show you how I blend it to make it match my hair. Like, I add brown to it. Anyway, let's get started. I comb my eyebrows in the direction I want them to go first. I don't know if y'all was able to hear me, sorry. Anyway. I comb my brows in the direction I want them to go in. And I take a brush like this. It's just a straight brush. I gotta learn the name of it. So I just pick up a little bit of the product. And just start drawing your eyebrow line in whatever shape you want it. I think y'all remember the zigzag eyebrows. That's why I said whatever shape you want it. Somebody wants to say hi. Say hey, bud. She want to say hi, y'all. She needed some attention, so there we go. I make it sort of like my definition of perfect, but you see how this is like brighter than the rest of it. So I'm gonna show y'all how I fix it with that. It's probably a little thicker than the other one too, but remember that your eyebrows are twins. I mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> your eyebrows are sisters, not twins. So if one of them is a little bit off, it's all good. So y'all just take this little brow pencil. It's becoming my favorite. It was the MAC eyebrow pencil. So you just blend. Just go right over it. But still try to stay in the direction of what, like whatever direction you brushed your hairs. So the part, you see the part with the actual my brows, um, I don't, I'm not gonna put too much in there. Just only on the parts that are shining through a little too red. So you see now it's a little, it don't look nothing like my other eyebrow now that I'm looking at it, but it's there. I got somewhere to be, so I don't got time to be perfect. So that is blended like to look more natural. And then I just put a little bit of gel on it. This is like brow gel. Shows I wear the red a lot because it was clear. Well, I call it brow gel. It's, it's clear. 
it's clear mascara, but it's brow gel, you know? It's whatever you use it for. So I found a little piece peeking through now. I'm gonna fill that in right quick. And just so y'all know, I really got somewhere to be, so this is quick. So, anybody could do it. No real excuses for crazy brows. At least not when you gotta look presentable. Oh, so now I take my Fenty Beauty um, matchstick, and it's in the color caramel or caramel however you say it and then I just use a random another brush that I felt like was good enough to clean my brows up so basically so now I can make this one look more like that one because this, this one's smaller than that one so I just take a little bit I brush back and forth like that you could be all neat like that but the main stroke, like main strokes that count are the last few. You wanna do that to loosen up the product and get some on your brush. I'm not playing with this product. Oh my God, I got it. Don't be such a neat freak because I got two little hairs that are out of place and it's really bothering me that they didn't get caught by the jail. That's those wild hairs. But if you make the mistake in tweezing them out every time, you ain't got no eyebrows like me. They just blend it down. Make sure that it is the color that matches your skin because you don't need to be having no white line under your eyebrows. I personally think it looks tacky. Unless that's the look you're going for. Like if you want to be extra animated. But because I'm not wearing makeup on my actual face, I would say don't do it. My hands getting a little shaky, y'all. I think they look a little closer to each other now. I'm not gonna bother with the top. Put your stick back down. You don't wanna come back to it and it's smashed or something but I just take my finger go under them to clean them up what y'all think leave it in the comments let me know what you think Show me pictures or anything if you are going to try it. Um, yeah. Hit me up. Sisters, not twins. 